to get better with my sleep schedule recently and that means setting an alarm to wake up at 9 a.m. It's going pretty well so far but I did stay up until 4 last night working so definitely wasn't ideal today but I feel like those days where my sleep schedule is about to get messed up are the days that it counts for me to wake up early so I can keep it going. I just feel like I really need to take advantage of the mornings more and get up and be productive and not sit on my phone and scroll for hours. So it is 9 30. I just showered. I took like an everything shower and washed my hair and my face and exfoliated. I think right now I'm going to start off with a face mask. I actually haven't tried this one yet. I love this packaging. It comes with tweezers to pick up the masks and there's actually 30 masks in here. skincare now and I love the packaging this is gonna look so cute just sitting here and I can just pop it open and use a face mask whenever I want there's 30 in here so I'm pretty excited I love my new coffee mug but it's like half the size of a regular mug so I'm having two cups of coffee today but it's only one it is very cute though it's very delish since I washed my hair this morning I'm gonna start with hair care as part of my morning routine I was thinking about wearing it natural today because it is curly but I think I'm just gonna do my usual I'm gonna put product in my hair and then blow dry and straighten it. I feel like it always looks better and lasts longer when I do the whole routine right after I wash my hair. My hair is done. It looks so much better. I have really been trying to take care of my hair and skin a lot more recently. So for my hair, I have a whole routine for after the shower when I'm blow drying it. So it's been much better recently and now I'm gonna show you guys my skincare. time of year fall and winter are always the worst months for my skin but it's pretty much been all year that I've been breaking out I've tried high-end products I've tried cheaper things and really nothing has worked I've been so stressed and I've had such an emotional year and I feel like it's all just taken out on my skin so recently I dove into Korean skincare and it has been so amazing so far I've been using these products consistently for like two weeks now I changed my morning routine I changed my night routine and I've actually seen a difference in my skin I break out the most on my cheeks and it's already clear cleared up so much around here. There are a couple breakouts, but I'm so excited to use these products long term and see how much my skin transforms. So I'm going to show you guys my skincare routine right now. I've been so excited to talk about these. So I got a ton of products sent to me. Some of them I had heard about on TikTok and others I was just trying for the first time and seeing my impression. So I'm going to show you guys the ones that I actually love and use every day. All of these products are available for purchase on Amazon. I will have everything I mentioned linked down below. So starting out with cleanser, I used this one this morning. This has been like my everyday cleanser, except at night when I'm removing my makeup, I apply this one first. So I use two cleansers at night. This one is great for taking off makeup and it's such a cool like applicator. It's like this little spatula and you scoop it on. And as you rub in the product, it like melts all of your makeup off. It's so good. Like it actually takes off mascara and everything. And then I finish off with this one for a clean face. I really like this cleanser so far and it smells so good. So now I have a perfect base for my skincare. I also did that face mask in the morning, which I really like. Liked. It smells so good too. This has been my favorite lip product recently and look how cute the packaging is So it comes with a spatula and I just scoop this onto my lips. It is so moisturizing I love it. My lips have been so soft next. I'm gonna use this serum. This is probably my favorite product I'm gonna show you guys in this routine. I love using this especially as a base for my makeup It's hydrating and it melts into the skin. It's a hundred percent cruelty free It actually makes my skin look so fresh and hydrated. This is a glow serum 
serum that I'm gonna be applying next. It's super brightening and moisturizing. So I just put this all over my face too. And I like keeping this in the fridge so it's super cold when I apply it. This is a dark spot glow serum. I use this especially in the morning. It's super brightening and lightweight. So I put this all over my skin too. And usually between the products, I let it sink in a little bit just so my skin absorbs everything that I'm applying. I just feel like the texture of my skin has improved so much since using it. These cleansing pads are also really cool. I just wanted to mention them. Since I use the face mask in the morning, I'm not gonna use these right now, but these are so cool. Basically, you take one of the skincare pads and split them in two and put them on your cheeks, and then you just let them sit for like a couple minutes. I love them. I feel like it's such a good refresh, like especially at night. So that is what I've been doing for my skincare in prep for my makeup. I also have an entire night routine with these products that I use also. eye cream specifically is really good. This is like so viral on TikTok and I have really bad dark circles so I've been using this every night to try to improve them. The cleansers that I talked about are amazing and there are a couple makeup products that I've enjoyed using as well. I'll show you guys some of the lip products which have been really good. So I'll keep showing you how I use these products throughout this video. So all of these products shown are available for purchase on Amazon. I'll have everything linked in the description. Amazon is also having a huge sale. So you can actually get some of these products for up to 55% off. So definitely check them out. I am so excited to use these long term. Like I feel like this has actually made a difference in my skin. Okay, I'm gonna finish my makeup. This is my setup right here. Like I have everything laid out in front of my mirror. Um, and then I have my iPad. I think I'm gonna watch The Office and get ready. routine using this lip balm. There are so many different colors, but I like this one the most. I usually don't like wearing color on my lips because I feel like a lot of the lip products I have are super drying, but I actually love this one because it's super moisturizing and the color isn't too crazy. Like it's really light, it's subtle, it kind of looks natural and pretty. And this is my finished look. So I have my hair, my makeup, everything done. This is pretty much what I do every day. So yeah, that is my getting ready routine. I am gonna change out of this outfit that I'm wearing right now. I'm just wearing something comfy to get ready. Since it is mid-October, I've been like really in the fall mood, but it's been so hot. Like this week it's been 90 degrees every day. So I can't really wear a fall outfit that I wanna wear. So I'm trying to mix the seasons by enjoying the heat of the summer and also getting into the fall mood. So I'm gonna put together an outfit that combines summer and fall. So here is what I picked out for my outfit today. I think it is so cute, like, you see what I mean by the summer and fall? Like, I'm wearing a skirt, short sleeves because it's so hot, but I tried to make it like very fall time. So I love how this came out. I just think it is so cute. So this is what I'm gonna be wearing to my appointments today and to work. I have on this top from Brandy. I love this shirt, I've had it for a while now. And then this skirt, which is actually also from Brandy. And then I have these tights on that I got at Target, some tall socks, and then my Doc Martens at the bottom. Bottom. And then I also have my everyday purse, which I feel like just goes with this so good. Yeah, this is my outfit for today. I love it. It came out super cute. It's flattering. Oh, my hair feels so soft. This is like a fall color scheme, so I love it. I just made my breakfast. It's very nutritious and it's just a really good breakfast today. Um, we have a microwave sandwich and it's actually so good. I also made another batch of coffee. So we're on three cups. This is actually like one and a half. I have an hour until, oh, I only have 30 minutes. I only have 30 minutes until I need to leave for my appointment. So I have my iPad here. I have my laptop right here and I need to get started. Um, 
what is going on today? I am dropping everything. I literally kicked over my coffee earlier. I was up so late last night until like 4 a.m. working on a video that I got uploaded. I need to clear all of that stuff off my laptop. I would love to say that I'm a very productive, on top of stuff person, you know, like as soon as I have an assignment or something to do, I just get on it and get it done. But that is not me. And it's really bad recently. Like I have had all these due dates and I've just been slacking off on it. I'm just going through this period of no motivation. And so it's impossible for me to get stuff done until I like have to get it done. It's really a bad habit, but anyway.